Hi everyone, my name is Holly and welcome to this backyard edition of Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader? This afternoon, I'm gonna be going head to head with two fantastic contestants, so let's meet them. What is your name? Kaden. Kaden, what grade are you in? Two. Two, and what is your favorite class at school? Jim. Jim, Jim's pretty fun. And let's meet our other contestant, what is your name? Kaylee. Kaylee, and what grade are you in? I'm in grade five. Grade five, and what is your favorite class? Um, I like socials and science. Cool. My assistant Timo is gonna be the quiz master today, so make sure to leave your answers in the comment section. I wanna know how many answers you got correct. All right, so the first category is geography. Timo, what's our question? So the first question is, what is the world's longest river? Ooh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. I know. I think I'm just gonna guess any yeah. river. I was gonna guess one, but I know. Okay, let's all guess a river. I just hope I'm gonna get this right. <laughs> I know, it's not a good I have start. No idea what it is. <laughs> okay, when everyone's ready, we'll turn around our boards. Okay. Do you need another second, Kaden? Kaden? No. You good? Okay, okay should we turn around our boards on three? Two, one. What did you what did you pick? Mackenzie River. I picked Fraser River. Fraser River. I picked the Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> so the correct answer was the Nile. Oh. The Nile. We, none of us got none it. None of us got it right. Nice. Alright, Quizmaster, we're ready for question number two. Okay, so the second question is Los Angeles is the capital of California. True or false? Oh. Um right. Hmm. Have you ever been to Los Angeles? Nope. Nope. <laughs> Kaden, don't <laughs> At least it's true or false, so we've all got a 50-50 chance of yeah. getting it right. Okay, we ready? Three, two, one. Okay, so I picked false. I did false. I did true. Okay, so the correct answer is false. Aww. Yeah! So the capital is Sacramento. All right. So Kaden and I get one point. Did you put your point down in the bottom? Yeah. Nice. All right, are we ready for question number three? Yep. Yeah. Okay. All righty. So which country has the largest population in the world? Oh. oh. Um, um, you, you said it. You, you guys said it before. Maybe. I forget it. Um, oh yeah. All right. I have it. I have it. I have it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, maybe that's not, but like No, no, I I know, I know. Wait, no, know, can you can you can change your answer if you want to. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just I'm just thinking that's probably right. I'm just, I'm just having a song. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, I think we're ready. Okay. Three, two, two one. Russia. I did. Russia. Did I did. did. I did India. You did India. I did China. I did Russia. Russia's I think the biggest yeah, I did. land mass, maybe? Okay, so the correct answer was China. Oh. Yes. India was second. India so was close. second. Close. I think they're really, really close. Yeah, it's 1.3 billion for China and 1.2 for India. Oh, whoa. All right, so that is the end of the geography questions. Let us know in the comment section how many correct you got out of three. Okay, we're moving on to the entertainment category. Yay. Do you feel confident about this one? Nope. <laughs> yes. All right. Are we ready for the first question? Yes. Yeah. Cool. Yep, okay, go. first entertainment question. What city does Batman call home? Oh! What city does Batman call home? I don't know if that's how you spell it, but I, I know, I know it's that! I know it's that! I think, I think we won't count spelling. If you've got, if we yeah, can yeah, tell yeah, what spelling, it is... Spelling doesn't count. No, if we can tell what it is, then I think you've got it. Oh, uh, I know exactly what city. <laughs> it's, it's not... Can I give them a hint? It's not a real city. It's not a real city. Not a real city. All right. I'm just gonna guess. I know I don't have it right. <laughs> yeah, I know I don't have it right either. <laughs> Is everyone ready? Yep. Okay, three, two, one. one. Gotham City. Oh, that's it, yes. yes. I don't think I, I did it home. I did. I did home. <laughs> that that's lives in your house. <laughs> I did Batmonious. Batmonious. That's not a place. <laughs> All right, so you get a point. Yay! Yay! No, but well, we don't know because we don't know yet. I think it's right. Yeah. Well, okay, sorry, Quizmaster. So the correct answer was Gotham City. Yay! Well done. I knew it was right. All right, question number two. 
Let's do it. And Dora the Explorer is Dora's pet monkey named Boots, Swiper, or Diego. Oh, I know, I know. <laughs> okay, at least there's like three choices I can I get. I know I have this one right. Same, I know same, I have same, this same, one same, right. Same. I know. I'm totally guessing. <laughs> Alright, ready? Three, two, two, one. one. Boots! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Drum roll, please. Correct answer is boots. Yeah! <laughs> We're all tied. Oh, we are! We've only got two points. Alrighty, what are Justin Bieber's fans known as? What? Justin Bieber's fans. Oh, I know um, this one. Um, um. <laughs> I'm just gonna be so random. I'm fun, so I'm doing that one. <laughs> <laughs> and he said, and he said, right, he doesn't can I know this is so wrong. Like, I know it's so wrong. That's okay, sometimes you gotta guess. All right, we ready? Three, Three two, two, one, go. I did beavers. <laughs> that's really close. <laughs> it would be that's so like, funny. That's, that's all I got. I have coffee here. Okay, so do we want to know what the correct answer yeah. was? Yes, please. The correct answer is believers. Believers. All right, now I know. He did, he did believe beavers. <laughs> believe beavers. It's believe kind of like our answers combined. <laughs> yeah. All right, well, now I know I need to cover my answers. <laughs> just, just go with me. <laughs> All right. Okay, so the next category is history. We're gonna do three questions. What company released the Macintosh computer in the 1980s? Oh, what? What? What company released the Macintosh computer? I don't even know what the computer <laughs> is. Uh, we need hints over here. The only hint I'm gonna give you is it's a fruit. It's a fruit? Oh, 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 oh. It's a fruit? It's a, it's a, the name of the company is also a fruit. It's also a fruit. Caden. Caden. Okay, we ready? Yep. Three, Three two, two, one. Apple. Apple. Oh, I guess. Yeah. Right. I think you I guessed think we're it right. Because right. I, I guessed helped them. you. Because you didn't know what a fruit was. <laughs> actually, 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 you didn't help me. I looked at you. Yeah! <laughs> so the correct answer was banana. What? what? <laughs> but That's it, a wait. Joke. It's, it's actually apple. Oh, okay. Okay, are we ready for the second question? Yes. No. Yes. Bill Gates is one of the co founders of Microsoft. True or false? It's another computer question. I'm Being almost ready. ready. There, boom. Okay. Three, two, two one. True, false. <laughs> it works as all. So the correct answer was true. Yes! True! I did originally true. Does that count? No. And then I was just joking around. Does that count? I think it counts. Yes. Yay. I think Because I originally just caught me Holly, his. Holly, Holly, Holly and me are tied. Alrighty, so for the last history question, where did the ancient Egyptians put a mummy's internal organs like the heart and lungs? Um, they, it they ate them. Under the mummy? In the sand? Or in jars? Yes, I like these ones where there's options. Yeah, and you don't just have to blatantly guess because, you know. Okay, I have my answer. I'm not smarter than a fifth grader. That's I am. impossible. Sure. <laughs> okay, we ready? Yeah. Three, Three two, two, one, go! In the sand! Well, why did I write true? Well, that's the last time. I okay. wrote, I put under the mummy. I, I put, put in, in the, the sand. sand. So the answer was in jars. Whoa! Oh, no! Okay, so the next category is arts and literature. Okay, so the first question is, who is Winnie the Pooh's small and pink friend? Um, 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 wait, um. give it, give us, give us, give us some answers. <laughs> give me the answer. No, give I don't me, think that's spelled no, right, but I know. Some answers. I know, I know, I know, I know. Small pink friend. We ready? I spelled it wrong. <laughs> ready? Three. Wait, no, 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 I'm not ready. Oh, okay. You're not ready, you're gonna change it. Three, two, one. Piglet. Piglet. Yeah. I was gonna do Piggy. <laughs> yeah, so the correct answer was Piglet. Piglet. Point for everyone. Yay. And I'm still an answer behind everyone. <laughs> what is the name of a mythical one-horned horse-like creature? Oh, oh my god. I know this one. Two, one, one. Unicorn. Unicorn. One unicorn. Technically that counts. I think it's pretty close. It's, it's, you know, it's just the better version. 
What yeah. is a haiku? A Chinese artist, a Japanese poem, or a martial art? <laughs> no, okay, you're not allowed. Okay, three, two, two one. one. Japanese poem. Japanese poem. Do we want to know the correct answer? Yes, yeah. please. Correct answer is Japanese poem. Yay! Okay, so the next category is science and nature. Who expressed the connection between energy and mass as E equals MC squared? Was it <laughs> Charles Darwin, Albert Einstein, or Marie oh. Curie? Okay. Okay, are we ready? I, I, I'm not 100% sure, but okay, three, two, one. Albert Einstein! No? <laughs> <laughs> so, the correct answer was Albert Einstein. Yay! You did it! No, I did! True, because I did like go crazy when he said it. So, the next question is What is a baby elephant called? Is it called a pup, cub, or calf? Oh. Are we ready? Mm -hmm. Three, two, one. one. Calf! The correct answer was calf. Yay! How many legs does an insect have? Two, four, or six? Six. Wait. Well, wait. some have more than others. You wait, 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 wait. Because there's like centipedes, and don't they have like a hundred legs? No. It, um, no, but look, the basic insect. Okay. Insects have like three. You ready? Yep. yep. Okay. Three, two, two one. one, six. Six. Four. And the correct answer was six. Yay! Because they have three legs on each side because they're made. So this is the last category before the lightning round. So we've got three more questions left to go that we get to write on our whiteboards. Do you want to know what the next category is? Yes. So we are going to be doing sports and leisure. Yes. Finally a round that I can finally win. <laughs> I don't know anything about sports. <laughs> okay. In horse riding, which is faster? Canter, gallop, or trot? What is canter? Oh, 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 oh. What is canter and what is trot? Um, They're a, all like um, this. A canter, a canter is when you're like, is like if you're, a trot is like, okay, I'm just gonna say this, a trot is the slowest. Okay, cool. So Oops. now you have to guess. Helpful information for me, thank you very and much. And there's gallop and, and, and canter. canter. Okay, are we ready? ready? Three, two, one. one. Gallop. Gallop! Oh my god, look what he did. <laughs> gallop. Gallop. All right. What was the answer? The answer was gallop. Yay! Are we ready for the next question? I'm ready. Yeah. Which of these games do not use a ball? Pool, ice hockey, or tennis? Three, Blue two, one. Ice hockey. 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 Correct answer is ice hockey. Yeah. Okay, last question, I think. It is the last question before we head into the lightning round. Okay. Hey. In what sport would you perform a slam dunk? Three, two, one. one. Basketball. 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 Oh, you drew a basketball hoop. Oh. So the correct answer was basketball. Basketball. Yay. I get two points because I did draw. Let's know in the comment section how many points we all have. Yay! All right, good job on the first round. Are you guys ready for the lightning round? Yes, but no. <laughs> so in the lightning round, we are bringing back the buzzers. We get finally get to use them. So here's how this is gonna work. Timo is going to ask us as many questions as he can in one minute. And if you hear a question you think you know the answer to, hit your hand on the buzzer. First person to get their hand on the buzzer gets to answer the question. Let's go. go. What Pixar film was set in Radiator Springs? Um, I don't know, somebody guess it. <laughs> Cars. Correct. Next question. What is the world's largest island? Greenland, Creek, or Iceland? Iceland. Iceland. No. Was that correct? Nope. No. Incorrect. Greenland. Aww. Next question. What body part do male crickets use to chirp? Legs. Back, back legs. <laughs> nope. What? Incorrect. What planet has moons named Lo, Europa, and Callisto? Saturn. Incorrect. Jupiter. <laughs> Time's up. She won. She won by, by one, one point. point. 
if you want to see more videos like this one, let me know in the comment section. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you get notifications. And we'll see you soon. Bye! Bye.